time has come. For me to deep clean my bedroom. Once again, I have moved my bed, giving me a great deal of open space. So I cannot pass up another opportunity. I could, but I'm not going to pass up another opportunity to have another try on video. Besides trying things on, a great deal of open space on the floor is good for laying flat on the floor and allowing your back to adjust. Oh, we tried. I'm gonna be trying on some vintage dresses that sisters found at the thrift store. These used to fit me really well, and then they didn't fit me because my weight shifted, but then my weight shifted again recently, so I was thinking, oh, maybe they'll fit me again. So I thought I'd like to try them on and see. Not that I'm going to wear them anywhere. I don't go anywhere, but that's beside the point. You don't have to go anywhere to dress up. One of them is actually a dress that was purchased for me new when I was younger, much younger, and now it's vintage. Here's the first dress. It's an actual gunny sacks dress. Okay. It fits perfectly. I was so sad when I couldn't fit this anymore. Why did I start with this one? This is my favorite. Although, you know, it would look better if I had my hair done. That's better. I'm so excited that it fits again. This is probably my favorite out of all of them. So I probably shouldn't have started with this one. I should have led up to it, but that's fine. used to wear this dress fairly often and I think every single time I got made fun of for it. I don't know, maybe it was just too costumey for some people or it wasn't in style. I don't know, I got made fun of a little bit and uh, did my best to ignore it. <laughs> Which wasn't super hard, it was a little hard, but it wasn't super hard because of how beautiful <laughs> it was and Oh my goodness. It's just so beautiful. Okay, I'll stop gushing and try on the next one. This one is just a little bit too tight in the arm area and right around here, just a little bit too snug. And I didn't zip it up all the way because I'm a little bit afraid I won't be able to unzip it. Yep, I'll just leave it unzipped. sack style dress but this is from a brand called oops double o p s i think it's kind of cute it looks pretty silly with the socks hang on honestly probably doesn't look that much better but the dress is cute it barely fits as well better than the last one but still just I need the snug right around here. Again, my sisters found this. I did not. Um, it was stained along the bottom, and I was able to get that out. Most of it. Oops, not all of it. Most of it. And then a lot of the braiding had come undone, and some sequins were falling off, and I was able to stitch it back together. <laughs> dress 
and when I outgrew it, I did not want to part with it. I just packed it away from the back of my closet and I have hung on to it ever since. I think it's kind of cute. <laughs> sure that I would wear it anywhere. It is a little tight around the top and the hips. Stretchiness is forgiving, but I'm not sure that it looks like it fits quite right, so. But it was kind of fun. Let's try it on. super flattering fit on me because of where it lands and all the gathers and everything, but I don't care. The sleeves. I, I love this dress. It's probably not super flattering too because of the color. Don't care. I think it's beautiful. Also, very noisy, but yeah. I feel very regal. Very 50s regal, if that makes any sense. Oh. I need to do a photo shoot, like right now. Like right now. I need an ornate couch in the woods. Me sitting on it. Someone's gonna have to do my makeup because I don't know how to do makeup. Those are all of the vintage dresses I had to try on today. I'm gonna get back to cleaning. Exciting stuff. Okay, see ya.